Okay, now see this question. We have to find the net capacitance between A and B. What we are given over here is a cube. This is a cube. Okay, this is a cube. Okay, a cube, and we have capacitance on each edge of the cube. Each of the edges having a capacitance, a capacitor of capacitance. Let's say C. So we have to find the net capacitance between A and B. How do we solve this question? So it's very easy. Let's assume that the charge entering from A is X. Now, by symmetry, this charge should equally distribute in the three directions because all the three directions are exactly identical. So here we should get X by three. Here also X by three. Here also x by 3 plus minus plus minus and plus minus we need to give the polarity now since here i have x minus x by 3 so what about these two plates so these two capacitors should have half of the charge x by 3 because again according to symmetry both the sides both the edges are identical in every sense for the circuit okay so here i have x by 6 here also i have x by 6 okay polarity plus minus plus minus polarity okay correct so uh, charge x is entering in the three directions it is equally distributed so x by 3 x by 3 x by 3 then again x by 3 will distribute equally so x by 6 and x by 6 now again i reach over here so again charge x should come out from b so x by 3 x by 3 and x by 3 should come from the three capacitors so again these three capacitors should have x by 3 charge plus minus x by 3 charge over here plus and minus and x by 3 charge over here oops i made a small mistake plus minus should be in opposite direction plus minus plus minus plus minus why positive negative so positive negative so positive and negative like this we have to go Okay, so that's why the polarities have been uh, selected like this. Okay, first plate is uh, positive, second plate is negative. So when I'm going from here, first plate positive, second plate negative, first plate positive, second plate negative, first plate positive, second plate negative, and finally exiting at B. Okay, so what is the potential difference across A and B? So V, uh, V, A, B will be what? I start from B. So for this capacitor, I get plus x by 3c. Okay. So x by 3c. Okay. x by 3c for this capacitor plus x by 6c. x by 6c. x by 3c, x by 6c. And then again crossing this capacitor. So again I get plus x by 3c. Okay. So I'm reaching the point A. So x by 3c plus x by 6c plus x by 3c and I reach the point A. So potential difference is this much. Okay. So this is equal to VAB is equal to uh, 5x by 6c. Okay. 5x by 6c. Now between A and B, I want a single capacitor of capacitance C dash. Okay. Now, the total charge entering from A is X. So, the charge over here should also be X. Okay, charge entering from A is X, leaving from B is minus X. Oh, sorry, yeah, yeah, like that. Okay, so X entering, X leaving like that. So, over here, what do I have? VAB equal to X by C dash. So, 5X by 6C equal to X by C dash. These two should be equal. So I obtained C dash equal to 6C by 5. So this is the final answer. Okay.